Chuck Wagon Trail. That was the hike that we were going to take, a long loop actually. We were going to be out probably for four or five hours on this hike. But things changed, and you'll find out why in a moment. We had parked at Mescal Trailhead, made our way across to Long Canyon, and then found uh, Chuck Wagon Trail. And as we walked, we didn't really run into very many people at all on this hike. It was a beautiful day, you know, the weather was nice, but we could see this creek in the, uh, in the distance there. I don't know if you can make it out. But as we kept walking along, that uh, creek, dry creek, seemed to become much wider and certainly a lot faster. But again, at this point, we didn't really think too much about it. You can see it there. It's, um, it's a pretty big creek. We did run into some cyclists, which we often do on these hikes. Hi. There he goes. Uh, I'm assuming that was his wife. Uh, she did not have as much success. I guess he was quite a bit further along by this point in time, but she eventually did get uh, back on her bike and kept going. These trails are harder than they look, that's for sure. So we kept walking, enjoying the weather, enjoying the beautiful scenery, uh, until we got to the creek. Don't get down, no, your feet are clean. Get your, get your socks and shoes, Gordon. We're gonna stall. <laughs> Believe it or not, we spent almost 40 minutes uh, watching the family attempt to make the crossing and deciding whether we would do the same crossing. The water was freezing cold and very deep. I mean, he was a tall man in that uh, video, um, but you know that water could easily have come up to the uh, knees, um, closer to the waist for Lorraine. And when we thought about it, we thought, you know, we don't have anything to dry our feet off and we just don't want to be walking around cold and wet, especially on a long hike. So we doubled back from that point of view. And that was okay. Uh, it was, uh, again, a wonderful hike. And maybe, you know, this is hike number eight, I think. Uh, at this point in time, it's probably good to take a bit of a break. <laughs> 